Today is the first day of September and to all Eurovision fans around the world, you know what that means. It is officially the beginning of Eurovision season 2023! Yay! <laughs> so as Eurovision season officially begins, what do we know so far? Well, the EBU has confirmed the contest cannot be safely held in Ukraine and as a result, it is destination UK for the contest. Seven cities are currently fretting it out to be host of the contest with Liverpool, Manchester, Glasgow, Sheffield, Leeds, Birmingham and Newcastle all vying to be the host of Eurovision 2023 with a decision expected on the final destination in the coming weeks. Israel have already confirmed that Noah Kyrell will be taking to the stage for them next year. Noah is a huge star and is already generating lots of publicity throughout the community. Ukraine's Vidbeer will be taking place in December. As the winners of the 22 Eurovision, whoever is victorious will have a place in the grand final. Some important dates for the diary are the Benidorm Fest finale will be taking place on February the 4th, the San Remo finale will be taking place on 11th of February, the Icelandic national final will be on 4th of March and Melody Festival and final will be taking place on March the 11th. I have made a series on the channel looking at each of the cities vying to host the contest so be sure to check that out. In addition to that, I have also made a video about the countries to look out for in 2023. The beginning of Eurovision season is always a special time. And although it is tinged with sadness that Ukraine cannot host, I know that the Eurovision community will continue to support the country and the UK will be doing everything that it can to act as a worthy stand-in. What are you most excited about as a new Eurovision season begins? What I'm actually looking forward to among the other things is who will represent Ireland at the contest, the national finals, which countries I'm going to like next year, who knows what those will be. Of course the pre-parties, that will be exciting and I'm really looking forward to that. But please do let me know in the comments below what you're excited and looking forward to. Until next time my Eurovision loving friends, wherever you may be, take care and see you soon.